Welcome to this magnificent home. Today we are in Carlswell Estate. My name is Mpochoma. I'll be showcasing this beautiful house uh, to you. So please uh, welcome me inside. The property has got four bedrooms, three upstairs, one downstairs, all en suite. It has a number of living areas which you will experience. Very classic, but yet modern at the same time. So if you don't mind, please join me. Uh, let me show you what this beautiful house has to offer. Okay, coming through this way, it's from the reception area. We land into this expansive uh, closed patio. We've got the doors open just so that you can feel the airiness of this uh, beautiful space here, which is excellent for entertainment. Uh, from out here, you step onto this open outside patio, which has got a, a beautiful rectangular uh, type of pool and you see also the extent of the stand which is quite huge. This property is built on a 2,200 square meter stand. I mean you know finding a property of that size yeah you would be very privileged. You have a play area um, on the right there. You have an in-ground uh, trampoline as well. So massive opportunity to do as much as you would like from an entertainment uh, point of view. If you are a green thumb, this is also perfect that you can do lots of landscaping in this property. And yeah, so uh, quite, quite stunning and beautiful. Come join me back inside. Let me show you the rest of the house. I love these doors, how yeah. you can actually close the patio if you wanted to, or you can keep it open. Yes, yes, yeah. Uh, great for, for privacy as well. So as we move from the reception area now into towards the kitchen, you see this beautiful uh, dining area. Currently, you have an eight-seater table, which for me is actually quite big enough for a ten-seater. You could actually have a ten-seater, and you have this door that opens outside into into the atrium, which is also a beautiful space where you could have a bench. Uh, you sit on there, read a book, and yeah, for relaxation, it's quite a, a nice space, a nice quiet space to be in. Now this way, we move into the open plan area, which on the right, it's a lounge. And then you have this beautiful kitchen. So the kitchen has just been revamped. Um, I think what, what I like about it is that it's a, like a gaily design with the center island, which is the centerpiece of this kitchen. I mean, it's, it's an ex extensive uh, center island with a prep sink. When you look to your left, it's your stove. Um, it's a gas burner uh, stove. We've got lots of cab cabinetry on that side as well. And as we move along this way, we move into the scullery. The scullery is also well kitted with cabinetry. You have a space for your double door fridge and you have space for three under counter appliances, which makes it quite functional as well as part of the kitchen. And this big door here leads into the pantry. So this is where you would store your food. And yeah, next to the kitchen is a mini uh, dining area which uh, complements the kitchen quite nicely. As much as you have a formal dining on the other side, but this also complements the kitchen quite nicely and it makes this expansive area uh, quite functional and efficient in terms of cooking, in terms of dining, and a perfect uh, space for that. Okay, so now we've seen that wing of the house where the kitchen is, the lounge is. Now we come into this wing where it's more, again, we have the third lounge um, here, which is quite private. So when you have uh, family gatherings, serious meetings, when you have a daughter, Lobola negotiations, this would be a perfect uh, room for that. So this is like a mini parliament, uh, mm. basically. Uh, which I is... love the gas fireplace. It will keep you nice and warm while you negotiate. Oh yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Should those people come in winter, yeah, you, you make them uh, you make uh, a, a fire for them and um, yeah, this is a guest uh, toilet and 
Next to that, we have one of the big uh, bedrooms. In fact, all of them are quite roomy and spacious. So this is a guest bedroom. It leads out onto a private patio um, on the outside through, through this door. And this bedroom is also and suite. So is all the bedrooms in this property. Which, this is perfect for an older person. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely, Joya. Yeah, so now that we've covered the downstairs area, we are going to move upstairs. And before we do that, I think on the outside, as you can see, we have ample parking space. We have three garages. We have dedicated parking for probably six or eight cars which is uh, quite great. I mean, if you have a 2,200 square meter property, you have plenty of everything. Okay, now we've come up to, we have two sets of uh, flight of stairs, one on the left, one on the right, which is quite uh, nice. You have a chandelier that complements uh, this look. You also looking at, you know, double volume, the entrance, all glass with wooden panels, which makes it great and airy. And inside here, we have a study area, which is also a pyjama lounge. And this also leads into the main bedroom, which we'll have an opportunity to have a look at. And additionally, there's a door that leads outside onto a balcony that overlooks the pool and the rest of the space. Uh, garden space outside. What I love about this is those doors that lead to the main bedroom. You can either use this like for the entire family using this door where you're standing uh -huh. or if you lock this, this could literally be an extension just for the main bedroom. So oh, that's yeah, quite absolutely. nice and versatile. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So we're going to move on to the right. Okay, let me close this door. This is the linen cupboard. This is for additional storage on this side and this is the main bedroom, as you can tell. The bed itself, you can have any side, size bed, uh, whether it's a queen or a king size bed, wooden floors, very nice touch. Uh, also has got a, a private balcony. If you step here, you step into the balcony with also views of the outside where you can see the pool. And this is also a space that is and suite. And as we step into the bathroom, you have a twin vanity, uh, very sizable shower, a freestanding uh, bathtub, and quite spacious. And to this side, you have the cupboards. Okay, we move from the main bedroom and we have a look at the two remaining bedrooms. The first, also spacious with a theme of blue and it's ensuite. Also its own um, access to a balcony that overlooks the pool and the garden outside. Beautiful cupboards that almost completely fill the wall on the side. You have mirror doors, which gives it a nice touch. But it's not fun for the cameraman. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to yeah. hide away yeah. from the mirror doors. Yeah. Uh, sorry about that, Joel. But yeah, at least, you know, people have an idea of, um, you know, the, the type of, of facility this is. So yeah, great um, setup indeed. Now to the final bedroom, also similar, um, you have the end suite bathroom, wooden floors in the room, spacious enough for a double bed, even a queen size bed, uh, similar cabinetry as with the other room, and you also have a door that leads to a private balcony outside. So that was the upstairs, wow. Yeah, so that was the upstairs. Blown away. Beautiful. Yeah, so beautiful, beautiful house. And yeah, we'll go outside to show you the rest of the house. 
Right, so now I'm doing a summary for you. Um, resting on a semi lounger here. This property, 2,200 square meters of stand uh, that it's built on, and four bedrooms, uh, all of them end suite. There's also an additional uh, guest toilet. So basically, we have four and a half bathrooms, multiple living areas, uh, an open area with the kitchen and a mini dining, spacious dining uh, room as well. Outside amenities, you have staff quarters. Uh, you also have for solar energy efficiency, you have uh, solar panels, a solar system basically. You have a borehole with also a 5,000 litre water tank that is connected to the uh, water system here in the, in the house. And yeah, over and above that, beautiful property at the back, pool, I feel like I'm somewhere in an island lounging here and massive space here. If you like this, like we do, kindly give us a call. We'll be waiting to make um, an arrangement for you for a private viewing. Thank you once again.